Hey guys and girls, in this video I'm going to be discussing the 18 volt LXT and 40 volt XGT lithium ion battery cell technologies. These being 18650 and these being 21700 cells. I was also asked a question recently on YouTube in regards to the amp hours of the batteries that come in the 40 volt kits, the 5 or 6 piece kits. And there are also some general topics that come up on building sites during discussions I have with tradies, carpenters, builders. So let's get into it. So what you're looking at is an LXT 18 volt 5 amp hour battery. Internally it's an 18650 lithium ion cell. 18 volt 5 amp hours. 36 volt 10 amp hours. This is a XGT 40 volt 4 amp hour battery. Internally it's a 21700 lithium ion cell. However, once slightly discharged, this is going to operate at 36 volts. So in reality, we've got a 36 volt, 4 amp hour battery. And if I want to directly compare these, I use the watt hour formula. My watt hour formula equals volts times amp hours. So with the LXT, 18 volts times 5 amp hours times 2 for 36 volts equals 180 watt hours for the XGT running at 36 volts times four amp hours is gonna be 144 watt hours. What does that mean? So watt hours is simply power over time. So that's how I'm directly comparing these two battery platforms. In summary, 36 volts of LXT batteries gives me more watt hours or power over time when compared to a XGT 40 volt, four amp hour battery. That leads me into the question asked on YouTube, which batteries did I purchase with my XGT 40 volt six piece kit. There are two, 2.5, four and five amp hour varieties. I've gone with the four amp hour batteries. That may seem inferior when compared to the watt hours of the 36 volt platform. That's okay, I have a very simple real world solution. I'm gonna purchase more 40 volt batteries. That's gonna double, triple, quadruple my efficiency, my productivity. There's going to be no loss of power over time when compared to the LXT platform. No dramas. A lot of conversations I've had on site recently with carpenters and builders revolve around drop saws and table saws, specifically 240 volt corded versions. The consensus is there is no 36 volt or 40 volt cordless drop saw or table saw on the market that is more powerful and or efficient than the corded versions. This is a 260 millimeter 10 inch drop saw. I'm looking forward to getting a 40 volt or 80 volt high performance version of this tool. If there's a Makita rep out there watching, hook me up. I'm in construction, I'm self-employed. I would love to get my hands on more efficient tools that can save me time. I'd rather be out for driving, to be honest. Comment if you would like to see that happen. I am only getting started. There is so much more detail about the different lithium ion cells inside these batteries. Hence the physical size differences. So let me know what you wanna see. Also to my Land Cruiser guys and gals, I appreciate you being so patient. The next video will be a front solid axle silver hub rebuild. So stay tuned, like, subscribe, I'll catch you later.